What's up guys, it's your boy Reeves. Woo! Got a graphics card right here and I'm bringing you another unboxing video. Uh, if you didn't watch my previous video that I uploaded a couple days ago or yesterday or whenever you saw it, I don't know. I was letting you guys know that I got a new graphics card which is right here in front of me. It's still sealed, brand new, haven't opened it yet. I picked it up a couple days ago. It's a, okay, don't judge me if I read this wrong. It's a <laughs> NVIDIA GeForce GT 630. Uh, two, <laughs> 2048 MB DDR3. Uh, that's pretty much it. I don't really know that much about graphics cards. Uh, apparently, this one was the best one inside the Best Buy at the moment. Let's show the camera right here. This is what it looks like. That's the back of it. It's still sealed, as you can see. Um, it apparently it's pretty okay. Like I was reading the specs on the back. Uh, I guess this is this brand is way better than AMD. Uh, currently, I just got a one gig AMD graphics card in my computer right now. So let's let's open this bad boy. Let's see what's in here. Let's see what it looks like. I, I honestly don't know what it looks like yet. So, well, we're both gonna find out together. But there we go. Sorry, I don't have a tomahawk or anything for these unboxing videos. All the pro YouTubers out there have like a big ass knife or something, and I just used a little razor blade so and another thing I hope I'm hoping that this one fits my motherboard I was told that there's certain models that don't fit certain motherboards so hopefully this will fit um, wow. uh, uh, I don't want to break it Where is? Uh, okay all right there we go I'm out. <laughs> it's all over again. Okay. So first off, we got a installation disc. I don't know. Yeah, I don't. I don't know. This is my first time I've ever upgraded my G card. It's the first time I'm ever gonna try to install it. Hopefully, I'll do great. But here she is. Wow, it looks. I don't know. I was expecting something a little bit cooler I'm not gonna lie so there you go there you have it that's what it looks like it has the uh, ports on the side got your regular um, analog I guess you want to call it HDMI and then HD ports it doesn't look so I don't know well I'm basing this on looks let's not base it on base it on basic it on looks. that's it that's all inside the box so hopefully um, I'll figure this out manual whatever uh, hopefully I'll figure out how to do this and now let's skip over to me opening my computer and we'll see where that goes so wish me luck and I'll fast forward in blah blah whatever what's up guys it's your boy reaps here again as you can see on the screen I am showing you my little fast forward over the shoulder cam of me taking apart my computer and uh, let me just say before I go into this whole experience of mine, this was my very first time. <laughs> As you can see right now, I'm looking at the manual for the graphics card that came with it. And I didn't want to do anything wrong. I didn't want to break it. I didn't want to mess anything up in my PC or on my old graphics card because you never know. It's always nice to have a backup. And it was pretty fun. It was like doing surgery on a robot. <laughs> it, was, it, it was my very first time taking apart my PC and taking a part out, replacing it with something better. And it took me a minute. I was messing around with it at first and I don't want to break anything. Then I saw that thing had a screw on it. So I took it out and there you go. That's the old graphics card. And I think I put both of them. There you go. A little bit for a second or two. And you can see the difference. It's not a huge difference, but it, it was pretty easy to install. I'm not going to lie. All I did was unscrew the side, take this little metal plate off and the new graphics card actually took up two slots instead of one. The first one only took up one space on um, your little motherboard thing. This new one took up two. So it was, I don't, I don't know, I don't, I don't really need the other three spaces, so whatever. But it was really easy to install. It was actually really easy to install. And um, right now what I'm doing to my computers, I'm airing it out, uh, dusting it, as you want to say, because uh, it was really, really dusty. <laughs> so... Um, I got my little can of air and started spraying it down, but that was pretty much it, dude. I took it out, put it back in, uh, installed the CD-ROM on the PC, and I was good to go. And what you're watching right now is my 
second time playing Warframe on the computer. And let me just say, the first time I tried to run this game on my PC, it was crap. I couldn't see anything. It would skip frames like crazy. It would freeze every second. I wouldn't even, I, it was unplayable. Like it was really unplayable. It was like I was looking at a picture slideshow. Like it, I would see a still frame, five seconds would go by of it freezing, another frame would move. So it's like, it was crazy. And I'm not gonna lie, it's not a great improvement. It's not the best gaming PC, but to what it was before, it's amazing to me. The game right now, as, you, as you're as you watching it on the screen is running at its highest video setting. So it was really, really cool. Um, also, this is like the, t the tutorial level for the game. So it was my first time playing it. Um, I'm definitely gonna be bringing you guys some PC gameplay now and see what happens. And I just wanted to say thanks, I guess, for watching the video, dude. It's another unboxing, as you can see, for the graphics card in uh, NVIDIA 630, I, I remember. <laughs> so, uh, there you have it there there's my unboxing slash installation slash quality review and i hope you guys like it i hope you guys enjoyed it i hope you guys got something from this video and if you did leave me a like leave me a comment and uh, i'll see you guys later this is your boy nightmare reefs and uh i'm gonna go poke people <laughs>